January and it is obscenely hot <laughs> in uh, the middle of the day. Um, so I'm just going to give my tips on how to deal with heat. Obviously, I, I don't do this very often, so I don't have the best, probably the best tips. So uh, leave some comments in the description below if you're from Australia or somewhere else where it gets super hot. Uh, but tip one is just like go out pretty early. Um, I left here at my house at 6.30 today um, and it definitely was cooler. Uh, obviously, just go higher up if you can because it's generally cooler when you're higher up. Um, so you can see at the moment it's like 25 degrees at like 7, 7 o'clock or 8 o'clock or something, so it's pretty horrible. Um, and it got up to about 40 degrees uh, at midday, so if you're, ride, if you're trying to do hills at midday, that was a big mistake. Um, yeah, so then the other tips I have is just like, obviously wear sun cream, but I'd say sun cream is good, but not the best. The best is just to cover your skin, so I always wear arm warmers pretty much when it gets super hot, because I really don't want to burn my arms, and I burnt them the other day, and they, super, they hurt a lot. You can also get like leg warmers if you want. Uh, they're not really leg warmers. When I say arm warmers, are leg warmers, I more mean like leg protect, like UV protection or arm UV protection. They're sort of seen as like they don't really like heat you up that much. It's surprising. You'd think you'd be a lot hotter, but they don't really heat you up that much. But they keep the sun off your skin, which is really good. Um, and you can also get one for your face as well. So I definitely recommend those if you want to cycle in the middle of the day, or even if you're just going to cycle where it's warm. It's just better for your skin, um, just to be covered up. To be honest. Um, my other tips are just like when it does get hot, don't go up climbs. Um, so like if you go high maybe at the beginning and then try and stay there, but don't do climbs because climbs you just go slower and get super hot because you're probably going to put more effort in. And even if you don't, you're just it's going to go slower so you can get less air cooling you down. Another tip is just go by the coast. It's generally got like a bit cooler by the coast, more more wind, etc., etc. So you just generally feel a bit cooler. Um, and obviously, like, try and keep intensity to a minimum. Uh, I think the thing is, it just depends on, like, what what you what you can do. Like, if it's just too hot, then you're just going to have to go out super early and try and do as much as you can. Or do, like, a split day where you do, like, super early and super, um, and super late. But generally, I found in Adelaide that the heat doesn't really go away. Like, it's still quite, it's still, generally, it's quite cool in the morning. And then once it heats up, it doesn't really cool down until, like, midnight. Um, so that isn't necessarily the best way of doing it. Um, apart from that, I don't know, just like drink, obviously drink loads of water, um, like prehydrate, like drink a lot of water before you even go out, um, just so that you're always ahead of it, so you're not having to hydrate on the bike, because it can just be hard to actually drink that much. Um, you can use electrolyte tabs if you, if you think it helps, I sometimes use them when it's super hot, but, um, yeah, and also obviously eat, like it can be hard to eat enough in the, in the sun. Um, because you're just like, you don't really feel like it. Um, so yeah, apart from that, I don't know, it's just the, those are the sort of standard tips um, for dealing with the heat. If you have any other tips, leave them in the comments below as I'd love to hear them because I I'm, <laughs> I'm get burned very easily um, and also I don't like the heat that much. Um, but you can definitely tell that some people do like it, um, like old Froomey. He loves the heat um, just because he's probably ridden in it more. Um, so cheers for watching and I'll see you in the next vid.